going on then. This is Nicky Gittis and you're watching Sport and Icons. All right, Declan, um, you know, I've probably seen you hundreds of times. I've, yeah. see, I've seen you uh, spa hundreds of rounds, but it's actually the first time I've ever interviewed you. Aye, and I had to, uh, It's good to be here, yeah. So um, you're going to be out again, is it two weeks Sunday? Yeah, a week Sunday. A week this Sunday, yeah, 20th of March, 19th and 20th. The st start on the, the Saturday, but I'm thinking that they're going to be a straight final on the Sunday. Um, so I can't wait. First time I've been out since 2017. Really? Aye, uh, for five years. So it's been training my balls off since Christmas, New Year. Um, sparring, running, everything. Putting everything in order. I mean, you've been an outstanding amateur for quite some time, haven't you? Um, um, are you looking to turn pro soon now? Yeah, yeah. Well, I tried last year and obviously they knocked us back. Um, previous things have happened in the past. Um, so hopefully... They said reapply in 12 months, so I've got two months left, got to reapply in May. Uh, so I thought in the meantime, instead of just training for nothing, I need like a, a goal fight. Uh, so I thought ABS is coming up, why not jump in, win these and uh, get a better deal turning pro. So is that the plan then, to uh, win it, not just participate in it? No, <laughs> we'll win it. I wouldn't bet it myself if I wasn't going to win it. Um, yeah, should. I'm confident that uh, I've got the skills to to beat everyone in it like so your your amateur days they go back to when like uh, Joshua was an amateur and all those kind of ones aye, didn't they aye uh, like say I was I was on the GB squad when I was 18 um, messed around a little bit got chucked off um, then things just went a bit downhill I just fell off the wagon a little bit um, the outside life outside of boxing wasn't the best um, hasn't been up till now but I'm still working on it trying to uh, just better myself and get back into it I right, saw so I was on the GB squad 2-9 um, I think uh, released as 2-10 I think Joshua and that got on in 2-10 or 2-11 mm -hmm. about then aye so it was just before them so aye do you miss them days? oh I had a class yeah just going out to Sheffield training for four days come back home training uh, just meeting the lads all make all the best amateurs in the in the country all meeting up in one place training um four times a day back then though hard uh but i loved it it was just going away and meeting the new lads and having bits of crack and that and i was good i really good missed the days so what's it like being part of the uh the northeast boxing boom with all the shows coming up here all the fighters obviously you've got like a robbie smazy over there who's your uh, stable mate as well what's it like being around the northeast boom right now Oh, it's, it's class, it's, it's mint for boxing at the minute. Um, North East has always been like overlooked sort of thing for years, even even in the amateur days. But now it's, it's kicking right off. Like obviously a lot of big shows in the North East coming up, a lot of talent. And it's just good to be around it all. Uh, like obviously a train. Oh, aye, loads. Should have motivated ages ago, but it's just, the penny's slowly dropping there. And just like getting on these shows and that is my, my aim, just to be getting on these shows, like with all the top lads. Do you know what I mean? Because uh, you're like a natural switch hitter, aren't you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you feel comfortable at Southport then? I, I both. Uh, <laughs> the coach is it's just laziness, but fuck, man, I've done it since I was a kid. I just like, I just, I don't know. I just seen someone do it in the gym when I was young, and I just, I just used to do it, and it just come natural because I, I naturally right with my left hand, uh, and play a pool and that with my left, but I play like tennis and that with my right, so I'm a bit ambidextrous. So that's probably why. I get it, quite good. So what's your motivation then? Uh, to uh, win the ABAs, um, reapply for the licence, yeah. all going well, you get that. Yeah. Then uh, you want to hit the ground running as a professional. Aye, aye, ah, yeah, just get the ball rolling and just get on as many shows, get out as many times a year as I can. Because obviously I'm 30 now, so I've only got five, six years. So I need to push on and obviously get my weight down. Um, and I should be hopefully going for titles within 18 months or something. Two year, let I less. Are you going to be going at heavyweight, or are you looking at a bridge or a cruiser? Nah, bridge or a cruiser. Um, I don't. I'm not big. I cruiser. I'm not big enough for heavyweight. Um, I'm like 17, 10 or something now, and like that's just. I don't have to lose any weight for the ABAs because the next, the next one down will be 14, 4. Now there's no point in would be killing myself to get to 14, 4 now. I'm just going to gradually get it off. Get there about 15, I've, I've, I'm a fight at about 15 stone. I'm a pro debut about 15. And then obviously for titles, slowly get down to 14 4. And um, if anybody wants to uh, come along to watch you, um, 
Where's it going to be? It's at Bellevue Leisure Centre in Hartlepool, uh, Sunday the 20th of March. See Demerara in action. <laughs> uh, a few knockouts coming your way? I, I think just like I've got the natural power, um, but I just get it in my head that I, I have to try and try and use it. I need to use it without trying instead of like loading up and trying when it, it just comes nat like you see there, it just comes natural. Um, I, 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 like, I always doubt myself. He says you can fucking punch. I, I spar with you fucking nearly every day. Yeah, I trust me, and I just think, ah, oh, uh, I just need to believe in myself a bit more. I should have been out of the ring that long as well. That's fucking hard. Uh, well, you you buzzed your lad in there. We won't say who it is, but you um, you did buzz him. I I uh, I had to stop for a bit, <laughs> and I was just without trying. It just comes. Like, that's what I need to do when I fight. Just let it come natural, and I I stopped and said, "Are you all right?" And that the tunnel it's yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's so you so you train at the Walls End Boxing Academy with uh, Rob Ismay yeah. over there with um, Nick Gittes and that. Yeah. Um, what is it about that gym? Because that gym always, I don't know, for me, it has like the right vibe. Aye, aye. It's just got just great people um, all wanting the same goal. So I don't need to be around them sort of people because in the past I put myself with other people and I act like them, like idiots. Right. Um, so all these are professional, they, they train every day, they live the lifestyle. Uh, it's just good to be around, obviously, because that's the way I want to be, but I can get dragged into two different lifestyles. Depends who I'm with. Do you know what I mean? I'm just fucking... Not wired up right. <laughs> well, I'm getting there. I'm, I'm, it's coming. It's coming. So do you see this as like a last chance saloon then? Just go for it now. Definitely, I. Um, like you say, I'm 30 now. It's a uh, last roll of the dice. Uh, I'm not going to get many more chances. Um, been out of trouble like two years now. Um, Stop fucking drinking and drugs and all that. Um, just sort my life right out. Because it's like, let's say, it's the last roll of the dice. Um, some, I'll do something stupid again and... It's going to another couple of years down the line. It's just not, I haven't got the time. So now's the time. Spot on. Okay, so if anybody wants to uh, keep up with your result or anything like that with your ABAs to uh, yeah. follow you on social media, Declan yeah, yeah. Fusco West. Newest. Declan Fusco Newest. Uh, newest. Okay, so I've been tagging you in the wrong one then. Uh, no, I think it's the newest. Declan Fusco Newest. Aye, aye. You've tagged us in it there. Okay. Um, on Instagram. Aye, uh, Declan Fusco Newest. And on Facebook, all right, follow us on there. And uh, season action, Bellevue, 20th of March. I forgot to ask uh, Rob his uh, Instagram uh, handle, but I'll put it in the uh, description box for the next one. Rob is my 87. Right, thank you very much. No worries. Cheers.